Greetings and welcome back to Crossroads Inn. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm pretty excited to be playing this game. I really love this game. I don't know what it is about it, but it's kind of crazy and it feels cool and it's fun. So anyway, we're going to be um, we're gonna be doing all the stuff. I don't know what we need else to remove from this universe. Uh, it looks like we have enough uh, space to buy the uh, extra tiles here for the kitchen and kind of expand things out a bit. Uh, let's go and click here and make sure that we connect it to our current kitchen. Yay. Um, oh, I forgot to mention about the tool shelf uh, yesterday or last episode. Um, this should go in a place that it is uh, not near guests because it has a very, very bad decor bonus. So we'll just leave that kind of by the door there. And um, yeah, we may move. Yeah, let's move these a little bit further. I'm thinking we might need more storage, but I'm not quite sure yet. So let's just see how things go and if we need anything else. Oh, simple kitchen table is unlocked. I'm getting nice stuff, getting nice stuff. Oh, this is great. I'm still dreaming of that massive counter here. That would be really nice. So what I'm thinking is we have those extra people uh, that we weren't sure what to do with like the thugs. Let's see, who do we have here as a thug? Fuad is a thug. Let's check him out and uh, and see. I'm wondering if he should basically be a carrier. He's speedy and he's tough, right? Uh, blessed with good immunity system. All right. So you know what? We're going to just have him do the carrying around. Uh, off, off, and off. Okay. And Balhadur, you're tough, you're persuasive, you're a gossiper and brave. That's one heck of a group of qualities there. So we're just going to let him do what he does and uh, hopefully he can get some stuff done for us. Now then, um, I'm wondering also if we should get one of these guys, uh, maybe a speedy one. Yeah, you, hey, workaholic. Yeah, we're going to get you to do the cleaning. All the cleaning, all day, all night. That's what you're going to do. Otter, I hope you like to clean. Yes, because I want this inn to be sparkling. I want people to have a great time and I want them to get us fame points. Um, what we can also do is we can change them to do different kinds of things with the sliders here. Focus on comfort and speed and quality. So I'm thinking he might... Uh, let's see, focus on their comfort, exploring, experience and loyalty grow faster. Thinking maybe speed here and quality, perhaps, like this. And don't focus on your own comfort. You know, you are irrelevant in this equation because we are workaholics here. We are slave drivers and that's how life goes for us. <laughs> it might also help to have a staff room where people can rest. I haven't experimented with that much, but I'm thinking it will give our people a little bit better... I don't know, better experience, better, better time working for us, perhaps. Okay, we definitely need somebody to be washing these dishes because some, we don't have a lot of mugs right now. We also don't have a lot of wine. What is this? Is this lager? Okay, thinking we need some wine. How much do we have in dirty cups? Like a billion? We have no dirty dishes. <laughs> Where are the, the cups? Where did they go? Where the heck are they? Huh. Okay, we have a slight issue with cups. Hmm. Where are the cups? Are they just getting washed? They can't all be getting washed at the same time. That's a bit silly. I don't know where the heck they went. There's no dirty cups. Game? Where did you put the cups? Hmm. <laughs> I'm wondering if I should add under the light over here as well. Um, I'm thinking about it because I think it's a bit too dark. They are complaining an awful lot about darkness. We could put a better chandelier here. Let's see. What, what, what are they like? This is fine, actually. We put one. Where's this one? So hard to tell. Oh, there it is. It's right there. Could put like one here and then take this one out like there. Maybe. And then I don't know if we want a, a darker area here, possibly. Maybe. 
torch, you like fire, me like fire. <laughs> Some of the text here is just absolutely great. I don't know, it's really funny. Um, let's see, do we have anything that we can do stuff with? Not really, poor kitchen table, simple kitchen table, nope. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to order some stuff, order some mugs. I have no idea what happened to those mugs. I could have sworn we ordered more and uh, they're just, unless the shipment was hijacked by random mug thieves or something, I don't know. It would seem very strange to me if they did that, but you never can tell. All right, let's go and choose some stuff here. Let's get our, we do need to get the wine one, two, three, four, and five. And then let's get the mugs. There we go. Get the rest here. There we go. Mugs. Excellent. <laughs> Such a weirdness. Such a weird thing. All right. Back to the inn. Ready for orders. I'd like to get another one of these hops. Um, I don't know. The trellises to grow more. Their first batch is almost ready. It needs to have one more growth uh, thingy. Or no, oh, maybe they are done, actually. No, They're probably done. All right, ooh, new need unlocked. Toilet, how nice. Oh, there we go, we can plant more hops. Okay, so now people finally feel the urge to go to the toilet. I'm so proud of them, yes. <laughs> it's so odd. So, so odd. Oh my goodness. Okay, homegrown. We're just looking at different things. Fame, I mean, we really need that. How did this not unlock yet? Remove 25 objects from the in surroundings. I thought that that was a thing that would just automatically happen, but I don't know if maybe it's not. Okay, in is really clean. Room looks neat. People kind of like the place. So I'm thinking this should grow f pretty f decently. Okay, let's go now, maybe. Can we get the skill we want? We have one point. Oh yes, look at that brewery. We'll take it. Oh, and we can change the name of our uh, tavern as well. Okay, we finally got the brewing. Oh, this is so good. Um, Yeah, having said that, where do we put the thing? Uh, no space anywhere. <laughs> This is not ideal. No. What we could do is we could move all this to the left, possibly. All right, let's find out how much this brewery is. I've kind of forgotten how much it costs. A thousand. All right, so let's make money. Either that or we can borrow money as Your well. I'm waiting too up. long. People are unhappy, but they should be thrilled. Maybe. I really want to make our own uh, stuff right now. Do we not have enough uh, people? Let's see, we have one, two, three, four people who should be doing stuff. I'm pretty sure those people are, are not out getting new pieces of furniture or something. I'm pretty sure they're here. The inn is too dark. We don't have proper equipment. That's surprising to me. Oh, we probably need, we probably need a shelf. Um, maybe that's what we have issues with at the moment. These things, though, this should store cups. Definitely should store cups. No. There's the storage settings. We have mugs in here. We have three sets of mugs, four times 20. So we can hold 80 altogether. That's, that's nice, I guess. Um, yeah. That's such a strange thing that we can't store those. But it should be fine. I think we should be okay. So if we have 58 available. That's all we really care about for the moment. Oh, oh, things are happening. Yay. Might move all that stuff. Thinking about it. Don't know about the graves. Let's let's just see about this whole thing. Let's move some items. Let's move the graves over here. And then we can move these trellises here. I think we can just put a, a door in the wall right here. So that will enable us to get out of the kitchen with this kind of like plain door. Yay. Uh, and then tend the crops right there. And that will be easier on our people. 
Let's get hops there. I want to move this slightly over. There we go. Considering taking out a loan here. The inn is too dark. Oh no. I really want some carpets or something. That would be nice. Um, let's see. Food. I think food should be fine. We have traveler's food. Different stuff. Oh wow. Look at our... Our peasant, our, our, yeah, distressed are not happy here. Apparently the outlaws love it, though. I don't understand why the distressed don't like it. Unless it's because maybe it's too fancy. Could the inn be too fancy for the distressed already? No, surely not. No, we, ha we have crap here, people. You can come back. It, it's fine. We have really crappy stuff. Many, many crappy things. We have, we have, yeah. Um... Okay, this is three stars. Maybe that's the issue. Maybe we're trying to attract the wrong clientele. We only have 14 people in the inn right now. Do we need to buy a better bathroom? We might. Let's see. Outhouse. Let's see. Out, out, out. We don't have any more outhouses. This is not ideal. Definitely not ideal. No. Um, okay. So these are percolating once again. I want to get that brewery because I really don't want to buy any more lager. So I want to buy that. Let's get this. It's right here. Ah, nice, nice, nice. We're just going to put it in its own little shed, I think, out here. Actually fits better that way, but ah, it's fine. We'll use this. That's good. Okay, and I'm just going to set this. Whoopsies. Hello. Let go. There we go. Brew. Lager. Yep. And now... Our lager buying days should be completely over. Yay! This is the way to make some profit early on. Because in the beginning, you know, rooms are very profitable as well, but people won't really stay unless they're like 13 stars. I think it's 13. Anyway, um, let's see. A new quest for adventurers. Where do we see any kind of fun stuff? Oh, here's a place with fun stuff. Hello, this is Sonneberg Mine. We can get a fence. Sounds extremely boring. Vegetable tar. Hmm. Sounds absolutely delicious. Let's go and do some kind of ad. Oh, we can't do advertising. No money. I really wish Escape closed those windows. Not a fan of this not closing the window thing. Trellis. Wow, thanks. <laughs> we already have it. It's kind of an odd thing to have that. Um, trellises and stuff um someone mentioned in the previous before the previous episode that the farmer area here had the brewery and we couldn't unlock it because of the way the game is but uh i don't know if we would have gotten the recipes even if we had so we could have gotten the brewery but maybe not actually brewed anything because maybe there's a knowledge component to the unlocks or something or you know abstraction that way okay we did cozy place fame no fame and fortune hooray okay life is now better so we probably want to work toward the dormitory but i think there's another thing now this this doesn't make any sense at all to me there's a well which we already get from the beginning and we already are allowed to collect water for free so that's kind of a useless unlock. I'm not going to get that one at all. Honey and wax, goods transported by carriage. That could be really good. I'm kind of looking for that one. Is it this one? Oh yes, it's the percenti looking one. Um, to lower the price of rooms. There's one here. Is there another one? Wow, that's quite far away. Let's see. New trade routes cost are lowered by 10%. Unlock bards. Better quality workers will start appearing. That sounds incredibly tasty. Uh, ale production might also be good. Um, I'm thinking also of getting like farming. Do we have farming unlocked? I don't think so. I think we actually need to unlock farming, which is here. Unlocks a garden to grow plants. Turnips are available. So we need the garden to get cereal for ale um but we don't actually have a recipe for ale yet so i'm kind of reticent to get that cauldrons for recipes more land you can't go wrong with more land i think we'll go more land yep there we go 
composter. We have more land after that. Mushroom dugout. All right, let's keep on going with this. Keep on going. Brew. Yeah, we're gonna brew the thing. Logger. So good. Yay! The town crier started advertising your inn. This inn is too... Why is it too dark for people? Who are these people who are complaining about darkness? Hello, darkness, my old friend, man. We have lots of outlaws and very few travelers. Now, if it's the outlaws that are complaining... Ooh, rent a bed! Oh my god, it's we have 12. Oh, oh, another person. Hey, hey. What are you looking for? You're looking for a bed. Hmm, you don't meet all the requirements. Really interesting. I wonder what those other things are. I think it's probably the AMD card thing that I can't see them uh, or something. All right, what do we want to look at here? Oh, the bed. Yes, let's go and get the bed. We need this bed. No, but we can't get it. Oh, no. Oh, dear. That's what moonshine looks like. Okay. Oh, we can't get the bed. These people should trade us the bed. We should we should be able to... They should like us. Can... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait. Hey. We did it, though. This is the furniture symbol. Surely. Hello. We want the bed. We really tried to advertise to you, but you're not giving us a bed. You know, that's really not kosher, man. You can't be doing that to us. Did we get this yet? Not yet. How's this going? This is very bad. Okay, let's get this going and unlock, please. Yay, yay, 48, the meow. Oh, the meow is real. Okay, well that's, that's <laughs> not available at the, ooh, hello, is that a counter? Looks like it, let's set otter out of, after this counter here. What kind of, ooh, mug of cider, yes, Reno, go for it. We need cider, yay. All right. Oh, wow. We've, we've done quite a lot here. Are we... Do we have this uh, thingy? We could send him after this rug as well. Nope. He already left. I think the guy already left. I'm not even sure anymore which one we sent. Ooh. Do we have... Do we have this bed? Maybe I forgot already. I, I feel like, wow, we have many things. Uh, but we don't actually have that many things. All right. We got a lot of space over here. I'm wondering if we should do a separate room for the um, for the rooms for the rent a room place. I want to rent a room. Yeah, I know. I would I would love to rent you a room. The I guess it doesn't matter because we're gonna get walls anyway. So we could actually put a room place here, but the money that's gonna be the hard part. At the moment, we can make <laughs> two squares of a room. <laughs> Which is not ideal. Definitely not ideal. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Outhouse looks useful. Okay, let's plant these. I want to check on the water level here as well. Water, water. There's water. Yep, water never seems to go down after you water it one time. So that, I think, is probably a bug. I wonder if I should add... I don't think I need to add more things like uh, more stoves. It seems like they can all use stuff quite happily without worrying up too much. Now, do I need to buy anything else? What are we short on? Looks like firewood. We're quite short on firewood. I guess I'll make more or I'll buy more of that. We need some fat. Your employee is um, up. Candles. Fat candles, firewood. Okay, let's go and shop for that. I don't remember where I saw the cheap firewood. It might have been like here at the Farmers Association. Let's see, fire, fire, firewood. Bread is cheap here though. Candles are okay. Lager is not needed. Candles, something in firewood. Oh crap, I forgot what I was gonna buy. I hate this. I hate. You know, memory is so sneaky. Firewood fat. That's why. Firewood and fat. Mm, they don't have it. They don't have it. This is not a good place to shop for this, clearly. Okay, so firewood. 
There's the fat. Okay, and we need firewood. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and fat. One, two, three, and four, and what else? Bread? Sure. Let's buy bread with the rest of those two thingies. Go. We'll take it. Oh, there are rats. Oh, no. So the rats, they actually get caught. This I found out. Let's see. Can we put a rat trap inside? I worry about this. It is, yeah, down, down happiness on this. But I feel like we should have like one inside at the least. Let's go and put some outside, perhaps. Oh, oh, that doesn't fit there because we're building at the edge of the world. We can put one like there as well. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully that will catch all of them. Yeah, people are still waiting. Ay, Gaspare. Leveled up. Let's see if we can do anything with him. I don't think we can. I think... Ooh, level 4, some of them. I think what we can do is when they get level 10, that's what I read in the patch notes, when they get level 10, they get to the next um, sort of tier of person, which is pretty useful. Okay, we have thugs, we have kitchen hands that are ready. Drudges, ooh, a bouncer, maybe. Do we want more drudges? I don't know. Loyal, these are all... I really love the icons on these. Yeah, sure. Mug of cider, we'll take it. Thank you. Yes. We need to go and buy some of that cider. But what I really like about these icons is that most of the time I can tell, like, are they good or are they bad? This is bad, good, good. Um, yeah. So what is this bad one got? No, it's not. This one is not bad. Oh. Yeah, we'll hire you. Andras. All right, Andras, you are going to be our next person here. Where is he? There you go. Let's go and check you out. Reputation. Yay. All right, carrying, cleaning. Yes, prioritize all that crap. All the good stuff. Maybe we should make someone a dedicated farmer as well. I mean, maybe not dedicated, but prioritize farming high onto the list. All right, we needed to go and get some cider. Or, uh, although we don't have it unlocked. Yeah, we don't have that unlocked. Let's see, we can get some other thing here though. Huh, we should get the beds. Let's get the beds. Rent a bed, hooray. And then, let's see, guess we'll start leaving tips. I don't know if that's functioning, to be honest. Don't know. Um, more storage objects. Sounds pretty good. We have guests are more patient. I think that might be a really good thing. Uh, the patience thing. Increase the number of workers looking for a job. I'd rather have a higher quality workers, I think, instead. That one's this one. But we could also start doing farming. Um, this, this might actually be really good too. Increases the maximum amount of goods that can be ordered by five. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. The gossip limit by 100 is also a good idea because these tend to like overfill sometimes, depending on how you play the game. Gambling table, washers. Let's see, workers get tired more slowly. Cauldrons, garden. Oh, there are so many good things here. Okay, let's get this. This is fine. And that also unlocks additional level of the inn over there. And I think that's a good choice. Okay, let's do that then. And keep on going. Yay. I wonder, I think I might borrow some money. I think it's a very good idea to borrow money. Why are they saying it's too dark? Like, this is such a weird thing. They're almost all outlaws. And yet they're complaining it's too dark. It's like, huh? I'm wondering though, one of the things that I'm thinking like, I'm wondering, hmm. I wonder if I should put another hall over here and make it for fancy people, you know? Like either travelers or nobles, which we don't really have unlocked at all. Or maybe we should just have one for the distressed people, but we have 24 people coming in here. So maybe we're doing the right thing. Um, we certainly are, yeah, we're doing, we're doing something here. All right, let's try and get ourselves some money. So there's a bank or two around here. Here, let's say hi. How you doing? 
Return in 20 days. I don't know if this has been fixed, but it seems like there's no penalty for this thing. But I'm sure we can make this amount of money uh, or 2,000 above this amount of money in 20 days. So I'm not really worried about this. What I want to do is I want to build a, um, let's see, we want to build guest rooms here. Kind of a big, long thing. So we're going to build a large dorm style thing. Now, the only issue that we're going to have is we have no cheap beds. Uh, we have these quite a bed. But I think we might even go with these fancy bed two, uh, just to get the room score up. We have, let's see, a simple dresser, which is one fancy. This is a changing screen, which is one fancy. So I'm thinking, like this is good also. This this is a fancy one, durable and tidy. This uh, keys bed, we have no idea what this is about but it's probably nice. It probably looks really nice. Let's look at how we have in terms of decoration. I'm just looking for fancy, fancy stuff. Oh, hey, this is great. Fancy two, and it only costs 150. Okay, so that's something we wanna look at. The Halloween decorations, I really don't wanna scare people at night. <laughs> so I think we're gonna put these Sambrian shields all over the place. This seems like a good idea. So I think we'll have a few beds. Let's check out the layout what, that we want to do here. What we're going to do is keep the game paused just to make sure that we don't have issues with um, not being able to sell tiles. So let's start out with three. Let's go to here and grab, let's see, probably I don't know how we want to do this. We could just do like a bit crazy and have as many beds as we could, or we could make it a bit fancy. I don't know. Um, let's see, fancy bed too. Or we could have like these maybe in the center. So they sort of radiate beauty all over the place. Um, I think I want to have a decent kind of like place here like this. Okay, what we want to do is move these this way and so that we can have maybe an extra tile on this side. I really don't want to have it quite that tight on this side, but um, yeah, and it won't be a lot of tile, that's for sure. So, but we'll, let's see what we can do here. Let's put maybe turn these around like this. Then we'd need an extra thingy over here. Hmm. Not quite that happy with this layout at all. I kind of don't want to make it like a stacked furniture silliness, you know? I'd rather have it be a little bit more manageable. Maybe this, and then add a few more beds over here as well. Just add a few more tiles let's see yep we'll do this copy do this and then add a few more of those and this room should be fairly nice let's look at let's pause the game and look at the numbers here okay it's not that high of a score actually so i do want to add let's add those decorative shields to this score what do we have on score we have, oh dear, I've lost it now. There we go. Guest room, one and a half. That's it. Aye, that's not great. So, time to get the shields out and start going. These are two, two star shields. Okay, and this side, sure. Shields all over the place. Yay, we love shields because we are shield kind of people. That's all I can say. We really, really love shields. So much so we put them in inside our beds as well. And life is, <laughs> I don't know. I'm just making stuff up now. <laughs> it's just, 
just silly. Okay, um, ooh, oh, that made a big difference. Very cheap way of making a difference. Okay, I want to get those last few beds in here. And hopefully we can start making a chunk of change uh, because we do have the people for it, that's for sure. All right, let's put this here, huh? Why can't I put that there? Hello? Give? Like, really? Come on. Maybe it has to be... Unhappy? Shields? Too many shields? It could be the shields, actually. So we'll, I think we have a little bit of leeway anyway. So it should be fine. Um, there we go. I could switch these around as well, but I don't think that's needed. I think we should be okay with this. Let's get our shields. <laughs> more shields. And more shields. The shielded bedroom. Let's just add them all and call this good. And hopefully that's going to be five stars. Oh, we're so close to five. All right, we do need to have a uh, door in here. So let's add a door because that's important. Um, let's have a white. Oh, how do we want to decorate this place? Hey, uh, we can have white brick or something cozier than bricks. I don't know. Red might be nice. Red is always a good bedroom color. So hopefully we'll be able to make like mountains of money off this place. Um, flooring. How's this? Well, that's quite nice. Okay. That looks good. Okay, and let's put a door in here. Uh, let's have a white door on the outside. That might be kind of funky. Yeah, there we go. White door and outside this place. This will be our guest room. Yeah, let's make it in red. Why not? There we go. So that's our guest room and everybody can see. Aha, that's the guest room. Do we have maximum thingies? Not yet. Put a couple more. <laughs> couple more shields. Oh yes. So much for not stacking furniture, right? Mm -hmm. It's fine. Don't worry. No one will notice. That's the, that's the good part about this is only these people will have knowledge of this place. I don't know if I should put any lights because this is a bedroom after all. I'm not quite sure actually. Uh, all right. So let's, let's see what this does. What do we got here for this? Five stars. Five star room. Holy fuzzy cats. Let's see. Let's see. Let's turn it down a bit. So happy, happy, happy. Yay. How far is the next one? 125 a night. You know what? I'm going to leave it at this level. Maybe we'll get a little bit more, um, I don't know, happiness from this. This room looks neat. You know what? I agree. I think it's great. Okay, room is happening. People are already like, we don't care if there's bricks on the floor. We just need a rest. Oh, wait, that's actually, uh, <laughs> it's our employees fixing this. Never mind. <laughs> this inn is too dark. No. Nope. New quest for adventurers. Yay. That's one thing I want to explore too is the, um, the adventurers part of this. Okay, they're all fixing stuff there. There is a bit of grass growing through the floor. Some flowers that adds to the ambiance, I think, <laughs> this place. So hopefully we're going to get customers for this. Okay, shelter. All right. The longer you offer beds for rent, the more guests will rent them. Continue, continue offering those warm beds to all those weary travelers. Have 20 guests spend the night. Okay, sounds good. Did we get one? Yes, we did. Shut up and sleep in here. Okay, build guest rooms. Got it. Did it. Done. We'll find out if this got fixed or not. I have no idea if people will rent their rooms or not, or how that works. My inn is too dark. Yes. That's funny because I have so many of these outlaws. Maybe they're, I don't know. I don't know, but I could, maybe I should make another hall out here or maybe I should move the kitchen out this way and then have more in this way. Just have a completely different room for um, nobles or people like that really like it bright. <laughs> the employee is leveling up. Hooray! All right, looking good. Let's go get these hops going. Always want to get those uh, working for sure. Okay, very nice. What else have we got? Nope, we're good. 
keep on going. I want to do, I do want to check that quest and see where we might have another, uh, something blinking at us. If anything, anywhere. This one? I think we saw this one already. Yeah, Trellis Land. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that. I've already got one, people. Hmm. What do you say about that? Okay, we have this one, I think, as well. Fence. Eh. I don't really care about fences so much. That's not interesting to me. I think we did this one already. Yeah, Green Tower. We have Ale, Cream, Fat, Hot, Spices, Medicine, Mixy, Stuffy Things. Yeah. Is anyone staying the night? Oh, there are people staying and paying my exorbitant rates. Excellent. Hey, life is now better. This is great. This is really good. So I don't know if they care about this or not. They care that it's dark. Did that guy just pray beside the bed? That was interesting. They're looking at it. They're looking and they're leaving. Let's see, what's happening now? Those people looked in and they left, and I don't know why. I wish it would tell us, like, is it too expensive? Or is it not fancy enough, a bed? Or is it too fancy? It would be nice to have some Yo, feedback from the, uh, from the, the patrons, you know? Because they're coming in and they're looking, but I don't know what they're thinking. They're not actually telling me what they're thinking, and they're definitely not beaming it to me psychically. That's not a thing. Yeah, these people are all leaving, and I don't know... Let's see, who are you? Who are you, dude? You are an outlaw. Maybe I need some... I don't know, outlaw stuff? Chains? Wait, these are outlaw thingies. Hmm. I don't know, though. <laughs> well, you would think. I don't know. You would think that those kinds of things would be, I don't know, outlawy, but you never can tell. It seems like a lot of people are rejecting this room, and that doesn't feel good to me. It's like, hmm, why are they objecting? I really want to know that. I really want to know what their their thoughts are for this. So that's a bit frustrating. Okay, Traveler left. Traveler liked it. Unless we're needing some, like, private rooms or something like this. Ooh, gotta make something tasty. Tasty is good. Jeez, we only have 12 people in our inn. I'm thinking we need to maybe... Oh, candles? Really? Okay. Are we actually short on candles? Oh, we have 15 only. We probably should get some and maybe some more wine while we're at it. Let's go and order those things really quickly. Oopsies. Uh, mansion please. Yes. There we go. Candles and wine. I believe we've been making uh, some of our own lager. So that's really great. Three, four, five. And wine here. One, two, many. Oh, we don't have limits anymore. Hey, this is nice. We have many, many things. What else do we need? Maybe, I don't know, firewood is expensive, but we could just get it anyway. I think I was going to put something on the menu that I've forgotten. Cider. We need to find cider somewhere. I think we need to find some cider. Let's see, where do we get this cider? Um, ooh, maybe here? Hey, cider, how you doing? All right, um, cider, yeah, right here. Let's get, oh, I don't know, how much fat do we have? 54, 34 eggs. We can do five eggs, one, two, three, four, five, and then 10 cider. Oh, and firewood is good here too. Let's take a couple of those. We have overpaid for that just now in the other place. Let's get this and we'll put cider on our menu because I think I've completely forgotten to do that earlier. Okay, let's add this cider mug of cider there we go boom and change the price to make it completely almost unaffordable <laughs> profits man we need the profits oh yes uh, this is looking good people are oh 
people are doing great. People are doing really great. And this is such a weird curve for me. I guess we got lucky, quote unquote lucky, that nobody's staying in our guest room. Maybe it's too fancy. I actually worry about that. Like maybe it is actually too fancy for people and they don't want to stay. They're like looking like, eh, not sure. So these are, this is a traveler guy. You can tell he's got a backpack. Who's this? That's quite a bed. Dude, you can't be called quite a bed. That The bed's called that. Can't go by that name. It's already taken. Transport with supplies arrived. Okay, we've got candles, some firewood. Would be nice to get that uh, chopper thing. Oh, we have a point available. Hooray. Ooh, we've got darts maybe. Tips. Now tips is kind of scary because I don't know if we actually get those tips. It might be a wasted skill point if it's still kind of buggy. Workers looking for job. Reduced cost of advertising. Guests are more patient. More land, dugouts, cauldrons. Um, I'm actually thinking uh, bread oven sounds really amazing. Better quality workers sounds really amazing. Um, are we selling anything? We're only selling wine. And I don't, I don't know where wine production is here. May not actually be on here. Let's see. I'll have to have a look for it. But yeah, money people are willing to pay for food is always a good thing. We could just take that and then not worry about, you know, maybe even lower the cost of food. Number of workers looking for a job. Storage objects actually sounds very good as well. Hmm. More land is never wrong. Um, I think, though, that I'm going to probably go for, you know what? Let's go for this chopping block. That seems like a very reasonable thing to do because we have lots of wood in storage that we can't use because we don't have the chopping block. And regular wood is always cheaper than firewood. So I think it's a good idea to just grab this, call it good, and um, yeah, do the thing. There we go. There we are, putting this down. All right, we only have two people playing in here, or playing, <clears throat> they're not playing in the bedroom. Um, they're sleeping and they're not doing anything else other than sleeping. Let's give them some privacy right now. It's fine, they're in separate beds, they're okay. <laughs> anyway, this is a good thing to have this chopping stump because now we can chop up a bunch of this wood and then not have to buy any more. I might have already said something like that, but uh, yeah, after the bed bedroom excitement, that was uh, most interesting. Wow, more people. Okay, so maybe it does gain popularity for uh, for this. Okay, so we have, let's see, we do have, a, we need another barrel to put in for the cider. So let's go and grab this thing. Let's pause the game because I want to put it in and then assign it immediately. So first of all, we're going to move the rat trap elsewhere, like there. And what is this? Small barrel called a giant's mug. Okay, I don't care about a small barrel. I just want big ones. Let's take this one and then just do cider with this. Okay, let's go out of there. Good, good. So, nope, not, not priority. No, I want this about. Yes, a storage settings, none. And let's get that cider to go in here. It's interesting what else can go in here. Like you can store water, flour, cereal. Um, yeah, barrels of flour. Beans, fish, serega, racore, moonshine, mead, marsala, liqueur, uh, lager, cabo. I never would have thought. Gamba, cider, and ale. So let's pick on pick the cider at the moment. Also do a higher priority for this because it's uh, we want the alcohol to be available to our patrons because that's what the game is about. It's about selling items, and we're selling them what they want to drink. So anyway, I think that this may be a fitting time to finish up this episode. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.